Hey, what's going on you guys? So I'm out at camp right now and I'm supposed to be cleaning. I got all kinds of chores to do, but I just got hungry and I'm like, heck, let's go hog hunting. Not to mention, I just got my new diamond. That's the SB1. It's the Edge SB1. Super cool bow, very affordable and uh, I love it. You can't get one any more dead than that. Let's go hunt. Had to make a pit stop. We got the giant here, Paul Cablin. That's his boy back there. That's Reef munching on some McDonald's. We're going to hunt us some wild organic pork. Currently, it's out there somewhere. It's up to us to find it. You're riding shotgun. It's about six o'clock in the afternoon. Got a southeast wind. We're sneaking up to a spot I call electric chair. I have a good feeling there's gonna be some hogs there. Just had a horde of hogs coming in on us. There was a bigger one there, but I picked out. I picked out a perfect eater, about a 40 pounder. We might have to put him on the spit, y'all. That arrow should be right in. There's the arrow. So, we just shot this hog. That ain't the only hog here, so. Really tricky. Gotta be careful not get caught.
so. Oh, he's dead right there. Oh my God, I didn't freaking. All right, you guys, so we're like sitting here literally going, the blood just stopped. Where did it stop? And we're literally not three steps from the hog. Like the hog's dead right there. All right, you guys, so if you want to watch me gut, skin, clean this hog, there will be a link to an unlisted, uh, unlisted video in the description below. You can watch that and then we're going to be cooking it back at camp. But I can't include gutting it and cleaning it in the main video because they'll, you know, they'll age restrict it and demonetize it and then it's really good for nothing. So I'll make two videos. But if you don't want to watch that, let's go to the kitchen. That's mama. That's Emma. Look at that face. You guys gotta see this. Hey, hello. <laughs> She's not a fan, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't like food. At any food. She does not like food. Dude, Arya. <laughs> So the other day, just at randomly, we were like, what is this? She goes, key. I was so stoked. So as you guys can see, our, our kitchen is a disaster. We are a disaster. We've been getting the ranch cleaned up and I got to, I, I just totally impromptu went out and hog hunted this afternoon, got the hog cleaned up. So if you guys watch that and then you kicked it back over here, hey, I need another one of those mouth calls. Aria chewed mine up. I don't know what to tell you, you ain't getting another one. <laughs> I need one more, Gabe. Um, I'm pretty sure they got them jokers at like Bass Pro Shops. What do you need it for? Uh, because I'm going to try to slip out there and kill one. Look, I'm getting ready to cook some food, okay? I'll hold at you, brother. See ya. Alright, so, anyway. If your life is as crazy as ours... Tell me what foods I can feed my daughter. She's seven months old and she doesn't eat at all. She's ate a few mouthfuls, didn't she? she now she, her mouth stays open so it all falls back out. <laughs> all right, y'all. So sorry about the noise. Here's those two pretty little back straps. And what you want to do is just um, cut the silver skin off of them. Just fillet it right off. And sorry about things being fast and crazy right now. I got a family who's hungry, and a baby who needs to go to sleep, and I guarantee you, a lot of you parents know exactly what kind of day this is. We're just trying to make hay while the sun shines. Take a quarter stick of butter, drop it in there. So my butter's getting nice and hot. Oh, I don't even season the darn thing. We're going with Everglades fish and chicken. As you can tell, a lot of thought went into that. Just take your seasoned up meat, throw it right in there. There's a anodized coat. The inside and outside of this little can cooker is anodized, so the aluminum never touches your meat. Now, I'm gonna throw in some two sprigs of rosemary, some celery and about about a half a box of this stock. Stir 
this around. Okay, so it's very important when you're doing this, you don't want it on too high of a heat. I'm gonna go to a six, which is about a medium. And then on your lid, there's this gasket. See that gasket right there? Go ahead and put it on there. Lock it down. Lock it down. I'm just gonna let that cook for a while, about half an hour, 40 minutes. I don't care how long it cooks. I'm gonna go properly say goodnight to my girls take a shower, get cleaned up, then I'll come back and I'll add the rest of it. All right, you guys, I am clean as a whistle. Both babies are out cold. Look how, look how pretty she is, y'all. Don't make me smile. Don't Aww, make me smile. She's so cute. <laughs> she's so cute. <laughs> Stop. You're going to ruin it. I have no shame. No shame. Yeah. This is... This, the face of a stressed out mama whose baby doesn't stop crying. So I gotta keep it clean and not smile while it's hardening. Oh goodness. So I don't know how long it's been, but I'm getting ready to open this up and add my veggies because we are so hungry. Throw in some baby potatoes. I didn't peel my corn all that well. Throw in some corn. A couple of carrots. Some peppers. back on the heat and we're gonna let this thing cook for about 30 minutes and it's gonna be good There's straight up goodness. Lord, I, I thank you for this day, and I thank you for this food, and I thank you for all of my many blessings. Lord, I thank you most of all for our strength and our health and our salvation. Please keep us safe and help us get a good night's sleep. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. All right, y'all. Was this a sour or a bar? I a boar hog. Boar? Mm -hmm. I never guessed that it would be a boar hog. Boar hog. That's a boar hog, y'all. It's really good. Tender. So tender. Like, really tender. That broth is so on point. How do you make it? Taste that broth. That's good. It's really good. <clears throat> it's really good. Ari would love that. Tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Yummy, yummy. In my tummy. Hey, thanks you guys for being a part of this. Mm -hmm. oh. We have tons to tell you all about. And we're just on the verge of letting you know everything. I will give you a hint. She ain't pregnant. So, <laughs> other than yeah. that, really cool stuff. And uh, that's all we got for you. But take care. God bless. We go. Bye.